Colorado. And then this story that just came down. Ashley Hodge has a big piece. L.J. Cryer plans to enter the portal. Uh, Ashley Hodge has a note in the premium section about speaking with his father, but he has informed the coaching staff that he is headed out somewhere else. In fact, Mike Bean on the Twitter, on the chat room mentioned, is it Kansas? Somebody else mentioned Texas Tech, but L.J. Cryer headed to play somewhere uh, else and not at Baylor. I, I think, to me, the most logical fit for him Especially if you're if you're talking about name image and likeness being a factor in this, and it absolutely has to be, would be Texas A and M. I, I really do think like he fits what Buzz does, and um, you know they need somebody like him. Uh, you know, hate to see him leave Waco. Um, I know that uh, you know Jack mentioned that uh, you know they that uh, Ashley might have told his dad that they played less physical in the ACC, and I I know an ACC team that was you know in last place in the league this year and. Love to have a guy who can score like that. You know, I don't have any NIL business there, but, you know, I could I can give him a good pep talk about it. Uh, but, no, I, I think it's unfortunate. But I do think that, look, with the guards that Baylor has you coming in. you think that that is going to be different than him wanting to go play for Coach Tang at Kansas State? Mm. See, I don't, I don't know if that's – I don't think that – I don't know if those things are going to happen. Like, like you know, the, the Scott Drew brotherhood, you know, with – it's it's L.J. Cryer's decision. It is absolutely. But I'm just throwing. I'm just using it's that. Also, as Jerome like, Tate's decision but Jerome too. But like, yeah, yeah, I have I mean, to like, like, you know, is there going to be transference there? I, I I don't know. I I think that there's going to be some of that um, eventually, maybe one day. But for a guy like L.J., I don't know. I like. I think a lot of it has to do with L.J.'s name, image, and likeness, much like Matthew Meyer. And is that at Kansas State or is that at a place like Texas A&M, mm -hmm. who, you know, made a run this year and, and got some rich alums that might be excited about basketball right now i mean i don't know if y'all remember when you brought this up like a week ago and i said like yeah we'll see as far as like him coming back and you kind of looked at me weird and i was like i mean we'll see and sure enough uh you know after he decides a week ago that he's gonna test the waters of the nba draft even though most people know that he's not gonna be swimming in those for very long sure enough he's in the transfer i mean i saw this coming a mile away nil absolutely at the top of the list uh, in my opinion as far as you know motivation goes and you know if that's the case which i fully believe that it is that at least that's one of the the top top leading reasons then that's the that's the water we're playing in now so that's yep. the pool he wants to swim in and uh, let's see what uh he's able to find but that's absolutely no surprise because that's exactly what i expected uh when he initially decided he was going to enter the draft and then you know very much left the door open to return into college i just i don't know how often it's going to be where guys test the waters or say they're going to go exploring and really that leads them right back where they were um especially you know a guy like him who you know for a fact will have big 12 teams and beyond having already contacted him i'm sure uh so yeah that's that's um a bummer for baylor basketball but i was kind of set it up to prepare for that or I, I was in my head i was already preparing for that and uh so we'll see if scott drew and staff were doing the same but yeah they've got a big player to now have to go and try to replace it is already uh, everybody all the fan bases are looking you know the opportunities and i've seen it already from tech uh, uh, kansas state fans among others like paul you mentioned a and m who knows maybe maybe it's uh e even somebody else in the state houston i don't know but there's that story with uh with lj crier when we come back a couple